Uh, there is a big misperception in the Latino community about weight. And when I came here, I learned, you know, what is preventive medicine, and I love it. I don't know what I'm going to eat next week, or and and obviously that brings a lot of junk food or or like you know food that is not. Um, they try to get whatever is the cheapest food, and they just go for boxes of things that are not very healthy. Um, but um, yeah, food insecurity is a big one. And when you are coming from the third world, obviously you are hungry. And if you get anything in sale, it will be easier for us to get anything that is in sale. I just go straight, and and I don't think. And it's uh, it's just that you have been coming from the third world. And when you go to McDonald's and you have 25 cents more for a double size, it's a you know, it's something good, and that's why you get the double size. And I live in the third world uh, all my life, and I know that um, I just, when I was trained as a pediatrician, I just saw kids that were dying. I never saw a healthy child or a healthy normal, because we just, nobody goes to do a healthy exam, or you don't have the money, or you don't have the power, or you don't have the knowledge. If you are able to maintain a healthy community, you can have a healthy country. Love is food and food is love for us. Um, the coming just from the third world. And, and I have a story of one girl that the fire was deported and mom was um, Mom was planning to bring all the kids to Mexico. I think it was Mexico, going back. And she was, the girl was very depressed, and we thought that she was depressed because, you know, her father was in jail. And then when this, the psychologist started working with her, we find out that one of the jokes or things that they said uh, at home is that, that parents were very hungry and if, if you and you can die in Mexico because there is no food and that was the main reason why she was so depressed because she knew if she was going to Mexico she was going to die because there were no food in there.